An avid runner asks, if I use sports drinks to up my endurance during my runs, is there any research that shows drinking it before sex also helps? Well, I guess it depends on how much you're sweating. Not being hydrated prior to sex can cause a series of issues. If there's not enough lubrication, too much sex can cause both parties, but typically the receiver, to become engorged and swollen. Irritation and chafing can even occur. You could potentially be at an increased risk of bladder, vaginal infections as well. For men, dehydration can lead to temporary erectile dysfunction. In order for a man to have an erection that's firm enough for sex, fluid levels cannot be too low. So increasing in hydration increases the volume of blood cells and plasma, which means that blood can flow through your veins and arteries more efficiently. A low volume of red blood cells and plasma can lead to ED because the penis cannot get enough oxygen-rich blood to maintain an erection. So maintaining hydration is a good thing, but typically you can do all of this with water. As an exercise physiologist, we usually only suggest adding electrolytes when there is prolonged sweating or you're engaging in physical activity for more than an hour. If you are looking for a sex-enhancing drink before engaging, try an energy drink or a cup of coffee. You're more likely to get aroused after caffeine because it activates the smooth and voluntary muscles which are present in the erectile tissue of the penis and the clitoris. There was a recent study that showed that men with higher amounts of caffeine were less likely to report ED. However, this was only true to a point. ED went back up in the highest consuming group, or those that consumed 300 to 700 milligrams of caffeine. For a comparison, a regular 12 ounce Coke has 34 milligrams of caffeine, and a 12 ounce Diet Coke has 46 milligrams of caffeine, both significantly less than coffee. I actually conducted a study on an energy drink where subjects received six cans, three of the energy drink and three of the placebo, and they were told to consume either the energy drink or placebo 60 minutes before sexual activity. Both consumers and their partners filled out questionnaires online within 30 minutes of sexual activity. These questionnaires assessed levels of orgasm, satisfaction, duration, enjoyment, and intensity, as well as pleasure and perceived sexual attractiveness. The energy drink influenced self-reported sexual enjoyment of male and female consumers, as well as sexual satisfaction in female consumers. Male partners reported significantly higher levels of satisfaction and enjoyment when females consumed the drink, and female partners reported significantly higher levels of intensity when their male partners consumed the drink. Keep in mind you start experiencing side effects around 400 milligrams of caffeine. And these side effects can be anything from headache, insomnia, nervousness, irritability, frequent urination, fast heartbeat, and even muscle tremors.